While Mercedes-Benz may for the most part be known for their extravagance and execution autos, it's no more peculiar to fit 4x4 fans. Since its introduction to the world, the G-Class has sparkled in circumstances that would leave lesser vehicles broken and stranded. While most proprietors may never push a vehicle like that as far as possible, realizing what it's equipped for is a large portion of the good times. Architect Jurgen Eberl chose that the G-Wagon couldn't have a ton of fun, which is the reason he made it an arrangement of entrance axles to a wagon to make the E-Class altering 4x4 squared. Now and then architects need to have a fabulous time, which is the manner by which we wind up with vehicles like the G63 6x6 and G500 4x4 squared. Like the all-terrain 4x4 squared, both of those G-Wagons are furnished with gateway axles. These unique axles put the focal point of the wheel underneath the focal point of the pivot, expanding the ground leeway without a major, low-sitting differential. The genuine test was adjusting the entryway axles to the E-Class completely free suspension. Ebriel essentially needed to check whether putting gateway axles on the G-Class should be possible. In the wake of beginning the undertaking, all his associates bolstered and helped him en route. The wind bumpers were 3D printed by the quick prototyping division while a vehicle planner assisted with the all-terrain 4x4 squared's matte dim wrap. A laborer at Mercedes-AMG conveyed an extraordinary drive shaft to Eberl in less than two weeks. All the work paid off. The all-terrain 4x4 squared packs 420 mm of ground leeway, more than twofold that of the standard model. It can swim through 500 mm of water before inconvenience begins. For examination, the G-Class is fit driving through 600 mm. New suspension segments enable Debril to mount the entry axles on the autonomous multi-connect suspension. Elastic and polyurethane bushings have been supplanted by unibull direction. The Haggles slash 50R20 tires have been pulled from the R-Class. We think they look much better on the all-terrain 4x4 squared. The width has been expanded by 20 mm to 2.10 m with a 1,772 mm track both front and back. Straight on, the all-terrain 4x4 squared looks wide and mean. This specific model gets the 3.0-liter twin-turbo V6 from the A400 wagon, a detuned adaptation of the motor that is in the C43 and E43 AMG models. In the all-terrain 4x4 squared, this motor sends 333 torque to each of the four wheels. The motor is matched with the 9G Tronic 9 speed programmed. Try not to get your desires up for a creation form. Not at all like the G63 6x6 and G500 4x4 squared, the all-terrain 4x4 squared is just a building test. All things considered, we're certain there would be a couple of clients around the globe willing to spend the cash for this rebel wagon.